Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's Cameron Sinclair. Today we are cleaning up my room. It's part two, okay? Now before I show you my room, if you're coming from part one and you're like, girl, what happened? Like, why are there stuff on your dresser suddenly? Why is there like bags and why is it more junk? Because your girl has officially moved out of her college apartment. I kind of like prefaced this in part one. You should definitely go watch it if you haven't seen it. But yeah, I give you the whole backstory of like why my room has been looking like this. I did have it perfectly clean and then we cleaned out my college apartment and suddenly all the junk is now here and I, I can't deal. What I will say is, one, I appreciate all the support. I so appreciate the non-judgmental support that you guys have been providing me. Love it. Hit subscribe though. You should stay a little bit longer because I have a lot of really exciting things happening in my life over this next month and I want you guys to stick around and see. Anyways, let's just get started. There's no need for a long intro because guess what? You have already know what the deal is because you watched my part one, right? Right? Okay. I'm tired of looking at this clean pile of clothes, so I'm gonna fold this first, okay? I can assure you most of these clothes probably aren't mine. They're probably my brother or sister, maybe my mother's, but it's got to go. So I'm gonna do everybody a favor and we're gonna fold, okay? Here's the empty basket for evidence. I'm gonna take this downstairs to the laundry room. I don't know why, but my comforter never ever wants to get dry. Literally, it's been in the dryer for over two hours at this point, and look. It's just... I have so many loads of laundry that I simply do not have time to just patiently wait for this to dry, so we're gonna do something else. This is your plan? So I fully recognize that this looks absolutely insane, but that's because I did my makeup over here and yeah, everything is everywhere. So let's just clean off this desk. the desk I don't know if I'm gonna add more stuff it's looking kind of empty but the desk isn't that big you know so I don't want to put too much and then ruin it I kind of like the clean look I don't know like, if anyone could tell me how to get I don't even know what this is off my desk nothing is working I think it might oh oh, oh I'm not gonna break the nail for that no. I am so tired it's after 1 a.m. so I'm just gonna call it a night and then finish this off tomorrow basically this is how I'm leaving my desk I kind of cleared this off I want to get rid of this okay like I understand that they want to like iron in my room that's cute um, but we need to put this somewhere else <laughs> for the time being okay I'm happy that my mirror is back in its proper corner and that I no longer have people's clothes in here. I folded them, you know, put them away. Now I need to figure out where all this needs to go. This was on my desk. I don't want to leave it on my desk because I just want to see the progress. You feel me? Tomorrow we're going to handle this piece. And honestly, y'all, we're almost done. Like, we're almost done. I think I'm going to keep this bag. Um, and then toss this one. I know this one is smaller, but it's cuter. <laughs> And also, I don't like the fact that clothes sometimes, like, touch my clean clothes. So, yeah, no. All right, I'm going to catch y'all tomorrow. I just read a comment that said, you have motivated me to start cleaning my daughter's closet. And you know what that did? Motivated me to start cleaning this godforsaken room. Again. <laughs> I think I'm going to start by making my bed first. Yeah. Now that my bed is made, I'm the worst at making a bed. I'm going to fold the laundry that I did in the last clip you saw. <laughs> I started the 
next project my senior year of college because I have so many Polaroids. And basically, I wanted to put them all in these lovely picture frames, but I never finished the project. And as you can see, they low-key ruined the frame. So, that's another issue. It's the way I have more of these. Look how many Polaroids I have. Like, this is insane. This black trash bag has been sitting in my room for the last, what, like, week-ish? Whenever I moved out. Probably, like, a week ago. Anyway, I'm going to dump it, and I'm going to figure out where all this stuff needs to go because it's just causing me to freaking trip. This is what I wore on my 21st birthday. I was dressed like Cameron. My cousin Sharnice made it for me. Ew. This is another one of those lovely snuggy things. This is my favorite thing ever in school. Like literally I was in it at least three, four times a week. I'm taking this with me when I move because what? But for now, I'm gonna put it where the other one is. I wonder if I should sell one. I don't know. The next thing I'm gonna do is dump everything that's in here into this laundry basket. Cause like I said, I like this laundry basket better and I wanna throw this one away. So do you guys see that? I feel like the last one was too tall for my closet. And I so at this point in the video, I lost audio, which is so freaking embarrassing. Literally I'm talking for about eight minutes and nothing, no audio. Basically I'm confessing to you guys a big secret that I've been holding. Just kidding, it's not that big of a secret. Long story short, I'm moving to New York City in about a week. Yes, that's the big life change I've been hinting at this entire video. Decluttering my room has made me realize how many clothes I've never worn before and probably never will wear before or just clothes I've worn maybe one time and just don't foresee me ever wearing them. And I can't pass them on to my little sister so I want to give you guys opportunity to buy them off of Depop. Because I'm moving in a week, I'm only selling these up until next Sunday, which I believe is like August 6th. Then I'm going to delete anything that like didn't get sold. If you want to check out all the items that I uploaded, the link is down in my description. I'm literally selling stuff between I want to say like $5 and I think the highest price item was 20. I don't even think it was 20, it might be 15. The only catch is that you have to pay for shipping because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to pay for the boxes. Yeah, sorry. Anyway, this is gonna be another shameless plug of me telling you guys to subscribe because like I said, I'm moving to New York City. Yes, the big apple. And I'm sure you're interested in seeing how that's all gonna play out, right? I'm talking packing up my stuff, moving up there, decorating my room, tours, exploring my neighborhoods. I'm excited. I hope you're excited too. Once again, it's so embarrassing that I lost the audio, but basically I'm explaining to you how I color-coded my closet. I went from dark to light to dark again. that all this stuff that's in here I want to pack and take with me to New York so I'm not gonna unpack this so I'm trying to figure out like where to put it so it's out of you know out of sight out of mind similar situation I'm just gonna leave my suitcase and my duffel bag here because I know I want to take those to New York with me so there's no point in me packing that up but look this is where we're at so far That's my work bag, that's why that's over there. I need to dump these two bags here. Oh no, I just found another bag of stuff, okay. I took, there was a hair dryer under here, I took that down in our storage place in the basement and then there was a computer underneath here and I also put that in the office. This is as good as the desk is gonna get. I just have too much stuff to keep it a buck with you. I'm gonna be 100% real with y'all real quick. I think I'm gonna just put this in the hallway so y'all can see what the room will look like after Tuesday. <laughs> Cause the trash bags, y'all know the trash bags not gonna stay here forever, but I definitely don't have nowhere else for it to go. So just so you can see what the room looks like clean, fully clean, I'm just gonna put this in the hallway for now. Don't kill me, okay. I 
am officially done cleaning my room. Are you guys ready to see? Are you ready? Okay, let's start. Roll the footage, roll the footage. <laughs> so happy right now i think i'm gonna light some sage and like just cleanse my room a little bit and then i'm gonna spend the rest of the night reading and i'm going i'm passing out because like this was very tiring <laughs> go ahead and hit that subscribe button because the month of august is gonna be absolutely insane feel free to follow my tiktok too if you want like daily content from me i'm trying my best to be as consistent as possible on youtube i'm doing better I'm definitely committing to once a week. So every Sunday, you're going to receive a video from me. But my goal is to post twice a week. So I'm just trying to see if I can like get into that flow. Let's hope. I don't want to say too much just in case I can't fully do it, you know? But anyways, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you next Sunday.